I think it's completely different to the vision that you have as a kid, you know, having that dream of just being on stage and singing and doing what you love. And then when you actually get into it, you actually find yourself doing less of the singing and more of the, just the talking and having to pose for pictures and stuff. That's not always great. We were uh, like always rowing with each other, the sort of teenage things. Well, no, you said it. Well, you said it. Well, you sound that. There's always someone in a group who naturally has that thing. I don't know what that thing is. And that person doesn't even always have to have the best voice or be the most talented. They just got that thing. Sugar Babes, still chalking up hits after 11 years. Total members across the band's history, six. Original members still in the band now, zero. I think that's what's helped the band last so long, because yeah. it's just a new personality, a new voice coming in. Yeah. Whoever wants to continue singing, you know, under the name Sugar Base, if it makes you happy, why not? Like, I've been in the group for ten years, and Mel's been in it for six, six yeah. Jade's been in it for two, so we've been that history of making, you know, building that name. I would prefer to remember it from when we first started going in and busting our butts to make a record. And that to me, like whenever I see Mitya, whenever we sing together, whenever I hear our voices together, um, and with Chabons as well, that's when I feel like a shoe of eight. You don't think I'm sounding bitchy, do you? So what should we make of the Sugar Babes regenerating again and again like pop time lords?